if you see a coin on a headstone don't touch it or pick it up here's why people who serve in the armed forces make a great sacrifice to serve their country soldiers leave their family friends jobs and everything behind to go out and serve their country some people stay in the military for four years and then go back to their lives Others remain in the military most of their lives and they make it their career Some soldiers spend their whole military career training while others spend most of their military career fighting on the front lines When a person enlists in the military they can't be sure that they'll come home safely It isn't just the soldier who makes sacrifices when they enlist in the army their families also make sacrifices military spouses watch the person they love leave not knowing if they're going to make it home safely They take care of the kids the household and try to hold it together until their spouse comes home. This is a huge sacrifice Soldiers know that when they enlist in the military, there's no guarantee. They'll come home safely The soldiers who died during battle make the ultimate sacrifice. They risk their lives for every citizen of the United States These soldiers who give their lives for their country's freedom deserve to be honored Memorial Day is a national holiday it's the day where our fallen soldiers are honored for their sacrifice Many people recognize Memorial Day as the beginning of summer. They have barbecues and parties Others recognize Memorial Day for what it really is a day to honor fallen soldiers There are parades and memorial services for our fallen heroes Because of the sacrifice that our soldiers make they deserve to be honored every day of the year not just on Memorial Day There's a way that people honor our fallen heroes all year long and you just may not know it Have you ever walked through a cemetery and see coins on the headstones? It's not uncommon to walk through and see pennies nickels dimes and quarters just sitting there People are placing coins on military tombstones when you learn why you'll pull out your change When you know the reason you also won't touch the coins that are sitting on the headstones. It's actually pretty amazing People put coins on the headstones as a way to honor a fallen soldier for their service if you see a penny on the headstone, it was from a person who's never met the soldier but wanted to thank them for their sacrifice. If you see a nickel on the headstone, it was placed there by someone who served with the soldier in boot camp. If you see a dime, it was placed there by someone who served with the soldier. If you see a quarter on the headstone, it was left by a soldier who was present when they died. The coins are a way to say thank you. If you see the coins on a headstone, you should leave them there. If you walk through a cemetery one day and there are coins, but they're gone the next time you go Chances are they weren't stolen from time to time cemetery workers will collect the money and it's donated to pay for the burial costs of veterans These coins are used to give thanks, but then later on they're used to help others. It's a beautiful thing Dave Taylor's a Vietnam War veteran while he was fortunate enough to make it home safely many of his friends weren't so lucky He's never forgotten his friends and he makes sure to leave coins on their graves regularly Honoring his fallen friends is important to him If you want to honor fallen soldiers, but have never served yourself bring a pocket full of pennies with you next time You take a walk in the cemetery When the fallen soldiers family visits the grave and they see the pennies that you left it'll mean the world to them It's great that there are ways to honor those who have sacrificed their lives for the country on days that aren't national holidays each day that we live in a free country we should give them thanks it's because of our soldiers that we can walk through the streets freely say what we want and do what we want to this is true freedom and thanks to our soldiers we have these things there are many countries around the world who cannot say the same <laughs>